Well, you see there, it's worth it to go back. There was treasure here. Hello, everyone. I am the Moy Chicken, and welcome back to more Hybrid Heaven. In the last episode, we continued Mr. Diaz's journey through somewhere underneath the subway as he tries to do something. <laughs> he unleashed all of the bioweapons, though, in the last episode, so we've gotten to start fighting monsters, which is exciting. Stop doing that, sir. All right. Uh, so now we're just going to keep on going. This is one thing that I would say is kind of a problem with this game, honestly. Like, when I first played this game, I had two major complaints about it. One is that they really don't explain the fighting system very well. I think probably if... Even if there had been some sort of, like, optional tutorial in, like, the, uh... On the main title screen or something, or, or, or whatever. You know, some sort of means to tell you, like, what you're doing. Why you're doing it any of that. But I think probably the rationale behind that decision was that a large part of this game opera especially early on operates on your not knowing what's going on, which is both good and bad. It certainly sets an atmosphere. Like this is it's a very atmospheric start in that like there's all these crazy things that happen right off the bat and the guy that you assume is probably going to be the protagonist turns out to get shot immediately and then you start playing as someone else like that's a that's a strange way to start a, a video game um but it's also pretty cool um so i don't know i'm kind of of two minds about it but i was very confused for a while when i first played this so if you decide you want to play it just understand that it's a little odd at first can i get that can I jump over there? I don't think I can make that jump, actually. Uh, uh. Ha! Yeah, I can't make that jump. Okay, well. Maybe I come back here later or something. Can I climb up here? Are there more things? No. Okay. Um. So, there's a door. Let's go check out this door. Let's keep exploring. Mr. Diaz wants treasure. I wasn't even aiming at that one and it took took damage. It's one of those kind of guns that like it's it's like a what do they call that? Hit scan where it just kind of uh like you shoot it and then whatever's the nearest thing takes damage from it. Um I don't think I can do anything in here, so see you later. <laughs> see you later, room. You've been great. Ah, these stupid little things. Again, those aren't the problem ones. The ones later on, those are the problem ones. All right, what's down here? I'll just jog along. There's a man! There's a man here! Mr. Diaz, is it true you killed our comrades overground and released the monster from the cell? How could someone like you do that? Unbelievable. An arrest warrant has been issued for you. Your being an executive will not affect how I act upon you. I ask for no resistance whatsoever. All right. Sure, I won't resist. Give me a sec, though. I gotta, I gotta charge up my power for an unrelated, non-resisting purpose. I gotta, I gotta neck throw you for an un, uh, unrelated, non-resistance purpose. Yep. I think I was walking away. Yeah. Yeah. All right. What if I middle kick you? <laughs> Eat it, orange scientist man. You cannot defeat Diaz. Yeah. Prepare yourself for the grabbing. Uh, what, what was the other I learned? Body slam. I think I learned body slam from that from uh the Nori monster in the last episode. Oh yeah. So if you if you start an attack and then cancel it, you lose a little bit of your power gauge. So it's not usually a good thing to uh. Push the button until you're actually ready to attack. Oh, so I haven't explained this yet. You see how his, yeah, how um, there's that little like white person symbol with like a red flashing arm in the lower right hand corner. That represents um your enemy's state. So because I've hit him enough in his what is that his left arm, um, and now his body, um, he is temporarily kind of like crippled in those parts. The same thing can happen to you as well. 
Um, so if, for example, my left leg was crippled, I would not be able to attack with my left leg. Um, if your body is crippled, it just reduces the, the rate at which you restore your stamina. So the body is not as big of an issue as the limbs. Although losing, like, getting damage to your head is awful because you, like, stay knocked out for longer. I've lost quite... There, there was a certain battle that I kept losing over and over again because the enemy specifically focused on the head and I would get knocked down and, and like, dizzy. And he would just keep wailing on me on the ground. So that wasn't much fun. Um, what's up here, though? Alright, let's see. So let's look around. Um, there's a, there's a bunch of dudes up there. Okay. Uh... More guys up there. A lot of robots in this lo this room. Um, some of those little guys. Uh, it looks like I need to go up. So I guess I will climb on crates. But first I will move in the serpentine manner because my control stick wants to. You really don't have to aim very much, you know, to shoot these guys. You pretty much just have to take your gun out and be close enough to them. <laughs> Also, very happily, their explosions do not do injury to you, which I'm pleased with, because I think that would be stupid otherwise. After all, they're just robots exploding. It's not a real danger. Aha, one of these. Yes. Break you. Shall break you. Yes. Yes. Okay. Very good. Shoot you a bunch, shoot you a bunch. I actually probably don't need to shoot them considering they're facing the wrong way, but whatever, I'll do it anyway. Alright, what have we in here? Oh! This man is here. Hello. Who are you, Mr. Weird Eyes? <laughs> Look at this guy's weird face! Oh, get away. Get away. I don't I don't like you. I don't like you. So these guys are significant because anytime you knock them down, they drop a, a minor healing item. So they're very, very important for healing powers. Ah, he taught me the low kick. Oh, the low kick is my best friend. I love the low kick. <laughs> See, he dropped he dropped a green green healing item. Then they kind of get confused, and you can kick them some more. Oh, he blocked anyway. Wow. Even though he didn't know where I was, he blocked from behind. Alright. I'm so glad he taught me low kick. Because low kick is basically a leg sweep. And it's extremely useful later on if you just need to, like, get an enemy on the ground for a little bit. Very helpful to leg sweep them. Oh, nice dodge, dude. And a guard. Ow. Let me grab you. Body slam! Ha! Eat it. Oh, you can see one of my legs is damaged. Okay, there you go. So I can no longer use my left, left leg right now, because it's injured. It's a cool system. Like, I, I like how it, it changes up fights just enough where like if you if you take a lot of hits or like in my case I've been guarding a lot with my leg and as a result it's now like slightly injured yeah give me more healing items dude this is very helpful another thing that's useful to know is to pay attention to like your enemy's positioning so like in that instance he was facing away into the like away from me into the left and so if i used my right leg i would kick him in the back and that would do more damage it's just kind of like it's neat how the game incentivizes you i'm very injured i just noticed i'm very injured oops i did not notice oh so good um the game incentivizes you to pay attention to like enemy positioning and like how you want to fight them 
And I think that's really neat. Alright, so that didn't lead anywhere, so let's go up. Okay, so this is another thing that I was stuck on for a while the first time I played it, because I didn't know that what I'm about to do was a thing you could do. I will show you. Walk a little bit closer to the edge. Uh -huh. Okay, well, anyway. So, you can, like, do this. I didn't realize you could do this. I think you do it, like, three times in the game? Maybe? You really don't use this feature very often in the game. It's it's very limited in usage. Um, and I just didn't know it was a thing you could do. Drop down. Who's shooting at me? Oh, you're shooting at me. Stop that. Herp. The other thing that, that got me right here was that that block I was just standing on was um, one of those ones you can blow up. And so I saw it and I immediately was like, oh, immediate knee-jerk reaction. I should destroy that because it's something I can destroy. And you kind of need it so you can shoot those guys. So this is very important. Ooh, treasure. I like treasure. Yes. I'm a very treasure-oriented game player. I do so enjoy a good treasure. The Offense Enhancer. That does exactly what it sounds like. During a battle, you can use it and it will increase your attack power. And what's cool about it is that if you use it, it lasts for the whole battle. So you never have to, like, re-up it, even if it's... Even if, um the battle goes on for a while. Like, all of these, uh, the enhancer items, which do I, how many of these do I have? Um, okay, I only have the offense enhancer for right now. Um, but those will last for a whole battle. So, like, if you have, like, a boss battle or something, just throw them up immediately and it will make the whole thing easier. <laughs> Alright, where am I now? Um, oh! Oh, I know where I am. I'm back in this room with the hanging thing. Well, can I get it now? Can I get it now? I don't know what it is, but I want it. It's treasure. I'm a very... As I just mentioned, I'm a treasure-oriented player, so I want treasure. What are these levitating bricks here for? I guess maybe this is a means to get to that? Alright, I gotta aim right at it. Uh, ha! Yeah! What are you? Inside is an offense razor. Okay, that's a permanent boost to my attack power. Let's go ahead and use that. Ah, my offense was up 18. Nice. Whee! All right, so we shut down the green gate, which probably means that we can now go through here. Nice. Screw you guys. Oh, oh, explosives. Ooh, these little mouse robot. Ow. Uh -huh. uh, you don't like explosions. What's up here? I'm not controlling this, by the way. Once you start the climb, it just goes. This is a Konami game, so it's like it's like climbing a staircase in Castlevania. <laughs> Bunch of dudes. What's in here? Oh, a monster. It's uh this guy. Hello. Oh, it's Nori Man again. Hello. I will now try out my new low kicks on you because I'm very excited to have them. Come here, sir. I wish to low kick you. Prepare yourself for the... Oh, they're side kicks, though. I thought they were regular kicks. Doggone it. That's not the sweep. That's the... That's the, uh... Like a shin kick. Ah! Curse you. Curse you, Nori Man. Teach me a new move. Ah! Ow. Oh, I'm so sad. I thought I'd learn the... I thought I'd learn the actual leg sweep, which is incredibly useful. It's just the regular low kick. Not as helpful. So, as we as we get through the game, I will gain more, like, st more power bars. And as you get more power bars, you can, like, do combo attacks. Thing is, though... Like, one of the other kind of uh, problems in this game is that your power meter never really fills any faster. It's always that same speed. 
And so if you want to do combos, you have to spend a lot of time just kind of like waiting, which isn't ideal. Eh. All right, getting stronger. There's my weird little mannequin over there. All right, what do we got in here? Oh, it's a locked door. Crap. Okay, well I gotta go find a. Uh, I gotta go find a key, I guess. Nuts. There's something up here. Aha! Is there secrets? No, there's not. Okay. <laughs> See you later. See you later. Oh, they're explosives! Ah, oh, they're here! Oh no! They respawned! Curse you tiny little robots! Walking down the stairs, walking down the stairs, check out my nice jeans! Ow! What the heck, man? I couldn't do anything about that. Stupid. Ah! Okay. So I didn't realize it the first time I played the game. I just thought this was background. This is actually a treasure chest. There you go. I didn't realize that the first time I played. That's a treasure chest. So well, there you go. There are two types in this game, for some reason. Um, I wanted to find a save point, but uh, it doesn't look like I'm going to find one immediately, so... We might just kill this guy and call it here. Hey, dude. How you doing? Are you ready for ready to get kicked? Here it comes. Would you care for another kick? I kind of like this guy. Like I like his design. He's like a creepy, you know, claw hand monster. Get kicked! Hehe. <laughs> See you later, bro. Alright, let me just check to see if inside this door is a, uh, safe. Diaz, please? Please pick it up. Diaz, thank you. Alright, let me look down here. Is there a safe point over here? No. Is there a safe point in... Nope. Diaz, please. Thank you. Diaz? Save point in here. No, but there is treasure. So I like that. I like treasure. It's always useful. So battle chargers are kind of like elixirs in other games. It's It restores both stamina and health at the same time. So. Um... But, uh, yeah, I thought there was a save point around here. I'm trying to, like... Re oh, Defense Razor, that's a permanent boost. Nice. I want that. Yeah. Oh, I feel better. Nice. Die, crates! You don't belong in this world. It's a Konami game, so I can say that. Stamina charger. That's just a stamp. That's a that's a stamina restoration item, as you might expect. I really thought there was a save point around here. I know I said I was gonna stop, but I really thought there was a save point right here. Is it over here? No, but there's this guy. You're not a save point. You're a guy. He's not very aggressive. He's just kind of hanging out. I right, see you later, man. Is it? Oh, this is a door. I thought this was a gate. I thought I had to do something special to open it. Oh, it's Bacon Man. Hello, Bacon Man. All right. Well, Bacon Man's here. Well, I guess I'll just end it. Um, I'm going to fight Bacon Man off, off camera. So when we come back, um, we will have defeated Bacon Man 
and we will continue our journey to find a save point. I'm the War Chicken. This has been Hybrid Heaven. And thanks for stopping by. Bring it on, Bacon Man! Prepare yourself for the kicks! Kick! Yeah.